Hello everyone, this is Platinum Spirit. We're going to be working on a car today. It was a bit of an issue getting one of the lugs off and that's why we are at this point in progress because I couldn't record, I didn't remember to, so yeah, here we go. So now what I'm about to do is have my worker remove the old brake and then I'm going to hand him or he's going to decide what he needs to do next. I'm just supervising, I already know how to do this, done it plenty of times before and we're going to get these brakes done in less in 10 minutes keep watching so right now what he's doing is comparing the size of the shoe pads against the old ones to ensure that he's putting them on correctly you always want to make sure you're putting them on right and that's mainly for safety reasons always know what you're doing before you do it as you can see these brakes here are completely worn down never have your brakes go that low if so you get to your nearest automotive department or you need to come to somebody like me I'll put them on for you for a small nominal fee. And as a courtesy, here's a close-up of the brakes, the old brakes, so that you can see that those are off. Those are completely off. And you can see the condition of them. You want to go ahead and throw those away. So what I'm doing right now is I'm examining the old brake pads for the wear and tear and just ensuring that there are no pieces that we can reuse. And I'm just also doing it so that you all can see what an old worn out brake pad looks like. It's actually a set. There's always two that comes with one wheel per wheel. There's two little pads. Y'all know what I'm talking about. So for a vehicle that has four tires, that's going to be 16 brake pads, but you're only going to need four kits like this one called Best Brake Select. And make sure you get the premium ones or make sure you refer to your manufacturer based upon the sort of car and model that you have. So right here, I normally make house calls. So this is my kit right here. But you have to do it by appointment. Spare the moment will cost you more. As you can see, I have my wrenches right there, my Allen wrenches. I have my sockets up there above. And I'm going to show you the rest of my stuff. I have a screwdriver. Just keep looking. I'm putting that one back that we were using. Mm-hmm. You see that? Yeah, so over here, as you can see, that's the socket wrench that I was using. And, that, and yeah, I did it in flip-flops. As you can see, my feet are out. <laughs> this is the jack that my worker used to lift the vehicle safely and take the lugs off of the wheels to apply and put on the brakes. It's pretty neat. And let's have a little musical interlude. As you can see, I'll probably one day get to wear my nails. So I'll be a hater, hater. Don't be a hater, hater. Da, 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 hater. If my hands look jacked up, you know what's up. So for now, this is the way I'm going to need to wear these nails. This is as functional as it's going to get. I cannot put these on because they're just going to break off or I won't be able to grasp my tools or certain things as I would need to. I want to thank you all for watching and have a great day. This is Platinum Spirit signing off. Looking good. Thank you all for watching to the end. Thank you all, 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 all. Thank you all for making it to the end.